Okay, so first thing, you're going to want to open up your Android Studio. Just go to the Start menu, type in Android Studio, open that up. And then uh, as soon as you get in here, you'll just want to open up the File menu. And from the File menu, you'll basically just want to go to uh, your Settings. So File, uh, go to Settings. And then uh, you're going to want to look for... And I'm just going to show you again. So go to the file settings and then Android SDK. And you want to look at your SDK tools. And you should see that your Google USB driver is installed. If it's not, just click the check mark and press apply. And then as soon as you have that, just take the location from the Android SDK location. Take that, copy it, go to run, paste that in, and then uh, go ahead and click OK. And so it's the same location, click OK. And then uh, from this folder, you want to go to Extras, go to Google, go to USB Driver, and then inside this folder is going to be all of your USB driver uh, for Google devices. And um, so once you have this location, you want to right click on Computer, go to Manage, and then you can open up uh, Device Manager. And then from Device Manager, you can find uh, your uh, Google Android device and uh, so go ahead and connect that. Uh, you also need to have it uh, booted into Fastboot. So uh, you can probably look up the, uh, the commands to get your device into Fastboot. And then once it's up into Fastboot, uh, you'll see it pop up in your device manager and then you'll be able to right click on it and uh, I just have mine uh, in the regular uh, Android uh, uh, regular Android device setting. And um, so you'll see it pop up as the ADB interface. And um, so just to show you, once you have your device booted up into Fastboot, you'll basically just go to uh, Browse, put in that location where you have your USB driver installed and then you'll just copy that over and uh, tell Device Manager to look there and then click Next and it should work if it's in Fastboot and then that's basically it. So that's how you get your drivers installed for your Android device.